I'd like to take, everybody take a long, deep breath. Think and feel the love and the energy in this room. I would like everybody to remember this from time to time because we all need to step back, take a deep breath, feel the love. We need to spread this love as a family and our feelings of peace throughout our lives. Love is contagious. It's like a virus, but it's one that we want to spread. So everybody have a good time tonight and thank you for being here. With you, I had an immediate sense of comfortableness, understanding and acceptance that I never felt with anyone. You quickly became one of my closest friends and somebody I could be my truest self with. Almost immediately, you became the person I wanted to call when anything happened in my life. And even though I was being stubborn at the time, deep down I can now admit that I had a weird, indescribable feeling that one day you would be my husband. To say I'm marrying my best friend is an understatement. You are my person, and since I met you, my life has gotten better and better with each passing day. I love our friendship, I love our life, I love our love, and I love you forever and always. First time I saw you, I gotta tell you, I was intimidated. Here was this girl, straight A student, captain of the volleyball team, president of an honor society, and then there was me. This nerdy kid who plays World of Warcraft in our living room. <laughs> I remember one day, after much consideration, asking Kellen if I should ask you on a date. And when she replied, no, I was okay with it. <laughs> I valued your friendship and was happy to have you in my life. This led us on a two week uh, trip to Europe, a place I had never been. And it was there I realized how much you really mean to me. You made me realize that the only limitations are the ones that we set for ourselves. You made me realize that there is so much more to this world than the place that I grew up. There are so many other amazing places that I would have never, <laughs> sorry, that I would have never uh, seen myself going, living and enjoying. <laughs> you are the strength I didn't know I was missing and the joy that I didn't know I lacked. Today, I choose to spend the rest of my life with you. Okay, what's a father say about his daughter on a wedding day? And I'm thinking, well, what cool thing could I say? How could I, what can I do? And I said, you know what's cool about Lynn and I being Alyssa's mom and dad? is that we are Alyssa's mom and dad, and that is really cool. I get to say in front of all you people how proud we are of that young lady and how much we love her. I have two older brothers and a younger sister. I've never had an older sister to follow in her footsteps. But you're like my older sister that I want to follow in her footsteps and be like. I'd like to toast to fate. Fate brought Stefan and Alyssa together, but fate also brought every one of us to their lives to celebrate today with them. So cheers to fate. I believe life is about moments, ones that can change your life with a few simple words. For us, those words were, we should go. Without those words, neither of us would be here today. But that day you chose to say those words. Because of them, we flew across the world together. That's when we smiled, we laughed, and we fell in love.
Thank you for all that you do for us. I am so ready to call you the most beautiful, talented, and caring person I know, and today, my wife. I love you, Stefan.